Hello everyone, and welcome to Stronghold on the Edge of Chaos, a Doom mod that I've been wanting to play for a long time. I'm just letting you know that audio is working on my end, because I'm going to shut up for this introduction video. I will see you guys in a few minutes, and I hope you enjoy. The year 2231 AD. Fifty years since the last major invasion instigated by the UAC's experimental portal technology, the corporation has become one of the foremost technology providers in the galaxy. It has now spread its already vast empire to hundreds of alien homeworlds, to which it now provides the latest advancements in its portal technology, military defense weapons, and biomechanical enhancement. The UAC has enjoyed a flourishing of its immense intergalactic empire for 50 glorious years. Not a single obstacle, not even a single demon in sight. Or so it thought. Through no fault of the UAC or its rival conglomerates, the Hellspawn have returned to wreak havoc upon the cosmos. This sudden incursion of demons is unlike any the UAC has experienced before. Billions of Hellspawn are arriving through huge demonic portals and invading countless major UAC installations all across the quadrant. And Hell's branches are bringing forth new demonic creations from every corner of purgatory, which even the most powerful of the UAC's defenses can't overcome. Due to the catastrophic loss of hundreds of brave marines in the hands of these hellish creatures, the once proud military branch of the Union Aerospace Corporation has been reduced to just a few. Sorry, but that's you totally a Ryan when it's on head. And now the only hope of holding off this demonic apocalypse. You have been instructed to ensure the total protection of 35 major UAC facilities rapidly being invaded by the abominable forces of hell. The odds are against you, and the demons are many. But now you have no choice. You must serve your overseers, or die. This is Stronghold, on the edge of chaos. Okay, so, like I said before, welcome to Stronghold. This is a Doom mod that I was talking about in some of my most recent uh, XCOM episodes, it should be 61 or 62, uh, that I recorded yesterday. Um, I tried to record this last night, but GZDM was being a shitter and crashing all the time, but I have a fresh install now, and I've playtested it. it, it works fine up through the tutorial mission, which is where I was crashing before. So hopefully we won't have any more issues. I apologize for the substandard mic audio quality in this series, but with the way GZ Doom mixes audio compared to the other games I play, I've been forced to bump my uh, I've been forced to bump my mic boost up, which makes me louder and a little worse quality. So I'm sorry for that, but it's it's the best solution that I know of. Uh, but anyway, just a brief overview for what this mod is. This is essentially Tower Defense Doom Edition, kind of. Um, Doom has been... There's a bunch of source ports for Doom, which is essentially making it compatible with modern systems and adding a bunch of new features and things like that. Uh, quality of life improvements, that sort of thing, like mouse look, for example, and just higher resolutions. Um, I might throw up a tutorial for uh, source ports at some point. I personally use GZ Doom. Uh, but who knows, if there's a demand for uh, tutorials for how to uh, get Doom plugged into a source port and start modding it up, I'll throw up a tutorial, but that's neither here nor there. Uh, about the mod itself, uh, an older source port, like really old, uh, for Doom called Skull Tag, uh, had an invasion mode where you and some buddies, ideally, uh, would team up and just, it was basically like zombies or survival from MW3. You'd hold off waves and waves of demons for as long as you could until you died. Uh, this turns that into a total conversion. Um, well, it, it takes inspiration from it and turns it into a total conversion and cranks it up to 11. Uh, there's all kinds of badass new weapons, uh, enemies, maps, an awesome soundtrack as you can hear. Uh, hopefully none of it's copyright because that'll suck. <laughs> Just get muted for half the video. Um, now there's a tutorial. There's a tutorial here uh, that I will let that I would normally let do most of the talking, but I can explain it on the field in about. 60 seconds, just the basics, so we'll do that instead of sitting through another minute and a half of tutorials. Uh, now, I'm not a bitch, so I will play on Ultraviolence, but this mod ain't no bitch either. 
It was designed for co-op play, and it's extremely, punishingly, ball-bustingly difficult in higher tiers. Uh, Cheesy Doom does not have multiplayer, and I don't play Xandronum because, uh, despite it having multiplayer, its coding is extremely outdated. I also just realized that my cursor is the wrong cursor. Uh, where... Where, where, where's my hexen cursor? There it is. That's better. Alright. Um. Anyway. Uh, yeah. I, I've tried to play through this on Ultraviolence before. I just got crushed. It, it's not gonna happen. So I'm gonna be playing on Hurt Me Plenty and hope that that's enough <laughs> for me to not die. Because I'm not in, I'm not some ridiculous professional. But I'm not incompetent. But I can't handle ultraviolence on this because it was designed for like two or three people at least. Anyway, enough ta enough chatter from me on the title screen. Let's just jump in here. Now I'm gonna skip this uh, briefing here because this is real simple. All right. See this shit? Demons come from here. You see this shit? Stop them from crossing it. If one of them crosses it, you fail. For every demon you kill, you get cash. You can spend cash at the base on Mars, aka here, uh, on weapons, power-ups, health and armor boosts, even reinforcements and, and auto turrets. Ammo spawns on the red pads between waves, health spawns on the green. Power-ups spawn on the blue, and new weapons spawn on the orange. Speaking of which, let's put the shotgun to work. And if you're wondering why these holograms are spawning blood, or are spawning blood pools, that's because I have uh, the, the, the Bolognese, Bolognese, whatever the fuck it's called, the successor to the Ketchup Core mod installed, and it doesn't really differentiate uh, between monsters in terms of what it bleeds. So yeah, there's that, but this is the only time we'll see uh, 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 holograms in this mod. Uh, if we run out of lives, we can always just farm up this, uh, this tutorial mission from Cash buy more. Uh, the HUD itself should be pretty self-explanatory. Uh, in the bottom and in the center, uh, well actually, uh, to the right of my armor, to the right of my armor count, that three with the heart is my life counter. Uh, and that heart with the three, uh, in the middle of my HUD, I'll pop my inventory here. Um, hold on. My are my controls fucked up? Because that's not what I had that bound to. What? No, that is not correct in the slightest. I have that to mouse 3, that to mouse 5, that there we go. That's better. Uh, anyway, that is considered an inventory item because that is an extra life. Thing. Basically, if you have a life, you have one in your inventory. And if you die on a map that has a jail, which I believe is most of them, you can pop one of these and get back in the fight without having to go back to HQ and restart. Get more ammo here and finish these guys off. Now I have a machine gun. Ho, ho, ho. Alright, now that I've playtested you beforehand, please don't die. Or, die? Please don't crash. I can't English today, I'm sorry. Praise God. It works. Okay. So this is the hub. This is this is your base on Mars. I'm gonna have to give you guys a little bit of a tour. You, there, there's these ads uh, that kind of shift around on the walls. They're everywhere. There's a lot of different people that you can talk to here. Um, yeah, Dr. Tagger for Flynn Tagger from Doom RPG, I think. If you hit E on these items, it'll uh, it, it'll give you uh, a description of it. I've only got 300 bucks to my name, but basically this is an extra life. Uh, that's a med kit, which it's like a stim pack that you can carry in your inventory that you can just pop and get 25% health back. And uh, the super med kit gives you 100 health back, but it's 200 bucks. Let's talk to this guy. Uh, please make sure to visit the training grounds before you start with the real action. I know what I'm talking about. If it's still too hard for you, consider a different skill setting. The amount of monsters per wave depends on the skill setting and the player count. Uh, are you ready for the next stop? I had a mission of... Uh, oh, on... Helizid, I think, a few days ago. 
Lost EWC installation, several Marines was a total disaster. I brought myself a weapon reinforcement unit, but obviously I had bad luck. It's a well-priced item, but you never know what, what might pop out. Yeah, there's, uh... Ah, oh, what the hell? I, th these guys are mostly just tutorials, tutorial spitters. I can just talk through all this. Uh, there is a... Um, over here. This is essentially the wall of Daka. Um... Talk to this guy? Oh, that's just, that's telling you how to buy shit. Okay, this is the random weapon device he was talking about. Uh, it'll give you any random weapon uh, when you when you pop it. Uh, it could be a shotgun or it could be a BFG. Uh, barrier kit. It's uh, essentially think of like those Covenant shield walls from Halo. It pops one down in front of you. Uh, this this one, quad damage, pretty self-explanatory. It's been a while since I've played this, so yes, I am kind of reading a bit of these off the wall. Shut up. Uh, Chronosphere, that stops time, right? Running short on time, Chronosphere... Yeah, okay. Yeah, you, so you can freeze time. Uh, that's a sentry turret. Yeah, top seller. No shit, these things are lifesavers. And, uh, you can spawn barrels. So you can basically lay minefields, which is pretty cool. Uh... Now, yeah, these guys... Y you can spawn in reinforcements for a hundred bucks a pop. Uh, and they usually have shotties or chain guns. Uh, but you can get one with like a plasma rifle if you're lucky, and the plasma rifle in this mod is mean. You can also get invulnerability for 400 bucks, which is real nice. Uh, this right here, you can step on, you can step right into here to refill your health between missions. Yeah, he just talks about that. Health pad 2000, as long as it's in an experimental state, it's absolutely free of charge. Just try it, and it's ruins and regenerates your skin. You'll feel like you just respawned. All right, UAC cybernetics, uh, independent. I don't know. I don't know my corporate acronyms. So yeah, this these are boosters. Um so yeah, you can heal yourself above 100% with these things. And uh same with these, they add shit to your maximum armor. Speaking of armor, uh let's head over to the armor shop. Right here. Caca plate. That's awful. Harder than a fire. God damn it. <laughs> All right, so green armor, it's just security grade. Uh, third of damage, so 33% damage reduction and gives you 100% armor. Suited more to open warfare against less powerful demons. This right here is combat armor. Um, much stronger variant, gives you 200, gives you 200 AP, and uh, I think it, uh, I think it uh, blocks half of damage. I'm not sure though. Yeah, and then he, he, here's the super shield, which I just called Terminator armor. Uh, 300%. And it absorbs damage entirely, as long as you have armor. How busted is that? But also... Oh, that's... Uh, no, yeah, there we go. Look at the price tag, 500. That's a uh, little spendy. Oh, oh, this chick! She's one of my favorite... She's one of my favorite NPCs to talk to. Uh, gummy really fat, uh, no. Just being nice. Why do we have to wear these ridiculous spacesuits? That's a reference to Half-Life. If I had any editing ability whatsoever, I'd edit in somebody going, Why do we always have to wear these ridiculous ties? Just mirrors are getting cold in this room. Uh, Marines are Graber and Hurricane. The, the, there's, there's one, there's a one or two lines that I really love. Um... I really hate the UAC, the benefits suck, the pace sucks, and the only thing they give you as a reward is this useless pistol, she says, holding a rifle. Somebody demons lower in the universe, where the hell, uh, gonna say something, but I lost my train of thought. Have you seen a missing pet demon? I know he was around here somewhere. Now, there are side missions in the hub. Uh, I don't know if this is actually one of them. I've never, look, look there, this mod is full of easter eggs and secrets and I didn't want to look stuff up last time I played it because I did I like I wanted to figure shit out myself like we used to um so I don't know if there's like a missing pet demon hiding in a closet that's just gonna rip out some scientist's throat somewhere but I'm sure it'll be fun to find if we can do that in this playthrough oh this is it now that Microsoft owns the UAC's computer system I know how many security flaws it has Fucking throwing shade! Go, going to the bar tonight, are you gonna be there? Uh, actually, no, because I'm playing video games instead of having a life with my friends. Don't you have anything better to do? Ouch! 
<laughs> and she just basically tells you to fuck off. Tired of some old, tired of the same old vacation planets? Try Focus Island. Project, Project Vega. It's not Mars, but it looks good. Who's this guy? Oh yeah, uh, th this guy's just another uh, advice spitter. Um, oh yeah, annual CTF championship. Join today for honor and wealth. How about this dude? Those are shops items are far too expensive. Make sure to earn enough cash on the battlefields. The stronger the demon, the higher the bounty, and don't waste it either. Only buy things that you really need or that are useful. Oh yeah, no kidding. If an operation's too hard and you keep failing your objective, join another op and then try later if you if you've earned enough experience and money. If you're still having problems, recruit marines and help you. What about you? Forget about it. it says Lieutenant Toenail. Ugh. I'm already in training for the annual Skull Tag Championship, and I'm not gonna let myself wind up in a demon's belly. Man, back when Skull Tag had championships. Back back when Skull Tag was a thing. Fuck, I'm old. Jesus Christ. Fuck, I'm old, says the guy with a massive voice crack. This teleporter is what we'll come out of when we finish any of these uh, Tier 1 missions here. Alright. Hello, sir. Greetings, Marines. They've completed the training course. Great. Time for some real action. Hellspawn have managed to, to attack us on our own home world, and our only hope for survival was retreat. Our spearhead of operations is now here on Mars, and our main goal is to regain control over Earth and the rest of our supercluster. Well, how do we do that? First of all, we need to secure our strongholds on several key planets in our galaxy and, neighbor and neighboring galaxies. Yeah, we're that far along. With these sites under our control, we can eradicate the demons from our homeworld and construct our, or, or, and conduct our operations in deeper space regions to take the rest of them down. So, this right here, we've got we've got to knock out Mars, uh, Maelstrom. Oops, pop my inventory again. Mars, Maelstrom, Crimson, and Sigma 2 in order to retake Holy Terra. Let's buy some shit and get to work. Okay, um, first I'm going to grab some green armor. Uh, should I grab a buddy? I don't know. Like, th this one's manageable on my own. This first, the first one I'm gonna do, I remember that much. Um, I suppose some health boosts couldn't hurt. Yeah, we're just gonna buy, uh, some of those. And we're gonna get a med kit here. We're actually gonna get two of them. And then we're gonna drop the rest of our cash here on more health upgrades. Because these are permanent. There, there's a bug where they can get stripped, though, and I, I can't remember exactly how it works, but there, there's a way to ensure that these are permanent, and there's something that, like, you, if you don't do, there's some way that, that, uh, I don't know, I, I think your health, whatever your health is at, if it's above 100%, uh, at the end of a mission, I think that's what it gets, I think that's what your max gets reset to. So, like, if I'm at 103 and the mission ends, then instead of my max being 106, it'll get dropped to 103. Uh, and in order to prevent that from happening, you just keep your health topped up at 106 at the end, and, yeah, you're good. So, yeah. Mission 1, Tier 1, Defense Deadline, 100 buck bonus, 10 waves. This will be your first major stronghold defense mission, Marine. Here you'll encounter the weakest of Hell's forces, but that doesn't mean you won't still have to be on your toes at all times. The difficulty mounts rapidly, so put all you've learned in, in training to the test. Let's go. Okay, can we turn this up? Wow. No wonder why that's so fucking loud, all the gunfire. Alright. Let's do this. This is the deadline here. They spawn... ...out he <coughs> ...out here. Here, boys. Watch them explode. God, I love the music in this mod. It's fantastic. 
Okay, oh, we, we got armor anyway. Well, shit, okay. Oops. Just gonna turn that down a little bit to make sure you guys can still hear me, which I'm pretty sure you can, but, like, I never really know it until... I never really know until I process the recording. And it really sucks if I spend, like, an hour of footage uh, for, uh, for stuff that you guys want to be able to hear me in. I'm surprised none of these guys are giving. Hold on. Doesn't Bolognese have... There it is. Single player, yeah. Um, Quentin Tarantino movie. Awesome. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I'm going to help for giving 50 of my... Okay, that, that's actually pretty good. Alright, that'll work. Come on, come at me, boys. Anything else? Nope. No chain gun yet. Those messages in the upper left corner, uh, I should pay more attention to them because they actually give you uh, intel about the enemies and shit coming at you and give you some advice in general about the maps. Um, like, I'll, I'll endeavor to read them for you guys if I remember to. Um, but usually I have other things going on because unlike XCOM, this is not a turn-based game where I have the luxury of being able to like stop and read stuff. I mean, the, the, these guys are... These guys don't stop and wait for me. Imps can be a pain. There's the minigun. Chain gun should help here. Go get it. With pleasure. There's the first demon. <laughs> Just look at it. Chew through him. Oh, it's so good. Ow, that hurt. I also love the UI in this mod. It's just really well done, and it looks really slick and clean. Yeah, top up on health here. Got it. Make sure to take out the faster demons first. Oh, that's a backpack. Pet the deadline without you even noticing. Backpacks double your ammo capacity for those of you who aren't really familiar with Doom. Oh god, those those are chain gunners. Okay. Alright, they're they're starting to they're starting to know you me here. Now my vest is getting shredded. I might want to go grab the other one on the pad after this wave. Die. Good boy. Hopefully I don't get executed for using heretic weapons. AKA picking up their ammo. SSG, baby. Give me that super shotgun. Listen to this thing roar. Oh, it's so good. Oh, look at him explode. Hang on, I'm gonna turn down that threshold a little bit. Minus 30, let's try that. That's better. Oh, fuck! There we go. I didn't expect that. Oops. Alright, well that, that was born of my own stupidity. So I can't really fault any- I can't really fault anything else for that. That, 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 that was all me. Die, you asshole. I know they're in the base. I know they're in the base. Die. Whew, that was closer than I'd like. I'm a little rusty. Oh, yes, mines. Did I get a rocket launcher at some point? Yeah, great, they're sending inspectors. I'm just gonna lay out a little bit of a marginal line here that'll actually work, ideally. Yeah, this is chain gun material right here. Six twenty-three, where are you? There you are. Uh-uh. 
There's one. Sneaky little bastards. I'm just gonna pop the regular shotgun for this just because it has a higher rate of fire. And just the stuff I'm chewing through is just gonna die in one shell, so. I don't need to waste ammo. Alright. Anything else for me? It's starting to get interesting. Yeah, I already died. It's been interesting. Just, this is starting to get interesting. That's all he's got. Oh! Okay, they're coming from two directions now. I forgot that that thing opens up. Oh, I guess I got more mines. Not a great amount of rounds. Alright, well I guess I'll just have to chew through these guys with buckshot. Oh, look at him detonate, you see that? I think that was part of his brain that went flying. Oh, thank fuck I dropped that mine there. That's a rocket launcher, boys. Any mines? Nope. Are they going to send barons? Well, there's Hell Knights here, at least. Okay, uh, pop that med kit. What? Alright, well, I guess I failed that one. Ow. Alright, well, that sucked. <laughs> yeah, so this gets pretty intense, and that's, like, aside from the tutorial, that's level one. So, yeah, I'm gonna call in some backup for this one. We're gonna get, uh, two of you fuckers. Um... Vest, which I I know we I know we're already gonna get one, but I uh, yeah I I I'm not really <laughs> interested in only having one set of armor for that entire mission. Um, what else can I get? I mean I don't have to spend all my cash, but I'll go ahead and pop a few health upgrades. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Da ah, fuck it, eleven. Alright, let's try this again. Alright, um... Yeah. Wish me luck. Gonna wait for him to close in before I start popping off rounds with a shotgun. Yeah, that's close enough. I was surprised he survived that shell. I mean, I did kind of catch him with a half blast. <clears throat> Grab that. We'll leave that vest there for later. Later on, I'm gonna start saving in the middle of these things. Like, I'll probably do like a, a save, a save, a. Uh, at the halfway point. So I don't have to go through the entire thing again if I screw up. <clears throat> Ammo's always welcome. Uh, 
That is a lot of dudes. I'm not calling in my uh, my reinforcements yet because I don't want them to die before the bigger shit comes. Because I know I can handle this myself. As nice as it would be to have some covering fire, I don't want to waste them. Because I can easily get a hundred bucks to just call in another one, but I don't want to waste what I have on the battlefield. I want to check behind here and see if there's anything. They like to stash weapons in secret spots around the maps. Ah, minigun. Gimme, gimme, gimme. I like to think I'm doing better this time around. Let her rip. Okay, they didn't they, they don't seem to like that very much. They've taken exception to that. Oh. Take out the hit scanners first. For those of you who aren't aware of just Doom terminology, hit scanners are enemies with weapons that hit instantly, like uh, undead troopers. Shotgunners, chain gunners, that sort of deal. Projectile based enemies are ones that do not hit instantly. Grab this backpack here. And uh, now I will call in some backup. Awesome chain gun. Alright, we pull up the bigger guns here. Take him out, buddy. Let her let it rain. I like how this guy's going full MP and just telling demons to halt. That takes some nuts. SSG, gimme, gimme, gimme. That's a whole lot of bullshit right there. He's about to die if he's in the middle of all this crap. Dude's facing down Hell Knights. I gotta give him some kudos for that. I think he, I think he just took one of them down. I think he just took one of them down. Yeah, there goes one. Nice. Hang on, let me, uh, yeah, 25. Yes, give me, give me ammo, give me mines. Alright, I'm just gonna fucking carpet the interior of this place. And six, five, we'll drop the others on the other side. There we go. Spectre down. Yeah, let's uh, let, let's start thinning the herd here. This is a little much. Take them down. I'm pretty sure you get money for the guys your uh, your allies kill. Man, this would be so fun to play with friends, but just nobody uses Skull Tag anymore, and I just don't use Xandrona because it's so outdated. I'm pretty sure the rocket launcher's back at base now, uh, and I just don't want to uh, abandon, uh, abandon the line here. Not leaving the battlefield, don't worry. Okay, is the base still intact? Yes. And uh, the thing's not there. Okay. Oh, that was a triple! Die, you fuck. Goodbye. Ah, oh, shit, he died, I think. 
All right, there's the launcher. And we're going to call in our other buddy here. Hold her right there! That looks like... That's a rifle. Yeah, okay. It's it, 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 it's launcher time. Also, it's medkit time. Alright, there's that taken care of. Oh, ouch. Oh, yeah. Is that does he just have a rifle? I think he does. Oh. That's a bluey. Just carpet the whole place in explosives. And let her rip. I'm gonna have to get a new mouse soon. Because uh, mine doesn't seem to want to uh, hold down, hold anymore. Oh, fuck. What's it? Yeah, we have Barons now, so uh, we're in some trouble. Oh, thank God those mines are so strong. How many fucking rockets does it take to kill one of you? One of them left? Where is he? There you are. Come here, you little shit. Alright, that'll do it. And I'm going to drop this down just a little more. There we go. <sighs> Alright. We've secured Mars. Okay, and now we've got some more cash to throw around. Awesome. This auto saves, right? Man, it's been a while since I've played that mod. Yeah, okay, so it does. Nice. Alright, uh, I'm definitely grabbing a turret. Um, and some more health upgrades. We're gonna bring ourselves up to 120. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. And we're gonna spend the rest of our cash on med kits. Yeah, because we're out. Come on, there, there it is. Two of them should do, mostly because that's all we can afford. All right, so yep, we've secured Mars. Uh, which one's the second one? That's mission three. Here's mission two. Sigma two, deadline $200 bonus. The acidic lakes surrounding the, per the perimeter of our strongholds on this planet are birthing, or, well, are bathing holes for demons. Expect the demon numbers to be high and the task of successfully defending the stronghold to be taxing for the amateur defender. And be sure not to plummet into the acid. Let's do it. Man, I remember this map. There's the deadline. Ammo for days. Gimme, gimme, gimme. And there is a shotgun over here. Yes. Start ripping into him. They, they eventually come from all three of these bridges, and it just turns into an absolute slaughterhouse. Yeah, j j just keep running into my buckshot. I'm sure it'll work just as well as it did for everybody in front of you. Imperial Guard intensifies. Continue to love the soundtrack in this mod. Yep, 
Yeah, thanks, private. No, that was easy going, but they're, they're, they're the weakest you're gonna face. Do I have to shoot you? Oh, you guys hear that crunch? Oh, damn. I love the shotgun in this mod. It's just it's so meaty. There's a, there's a joke in there somewhere. Either way, shut up. I would be, I would be uh, straight dodging, but I don't want to pop off the bridge. After all, dissolved in acid doesn't sound like my kind of tombstone. I'm just holding down the mouse button at this point. Just indiscriminate DACA. Die, you big ugly shit. Alright, let's see what we got. Ammo. Minigun, hell yeah. Gimme that. I will absolutely take that backpack. All right, <laughs> let's. Oh, specters! I see one on the right in the center there. Come on, die! Are there two of them? Well, not anymore. Damn, you just chew through, chew, chew through ammo so fast in this mod. It's crazy. Can I get an SSG somewhere, please? Oh, that's a double. Ow. Come on, die. Thank you. Man, the, the modding scene for Doom still continues to astonish me with how much it's able to pull off. That's an auto shotgun, I believe. Yep. So yeah, this thing's mag-fed. Oh, those are mech demons. Oh, listen to it. Listen to her roar. I think these things have double the health of uh, regular demons. Or, but, and by that I mean pinkies. I don't think so. Ow. That fucking hurt. Let's clean up the rest of these guys. There's only five of them left. Starting to run a little thin on shells, though. Got more than enough. Uh, okay, we need health. We don't have any health. Okay. Oops. Alright. And there is no manual reloading in this mod. Unfortunately. Health, health, give me health. Ha ha ha. All right, I'm gonna drop this turret uh, right there. Oh fuck, they have rocketeers. As if I wasn't already boned enough, we're throwing this at me. All right. This is actually a really small wave, I'm surprised. Yeah, turrets lighten them up. Alright, let's get back up there. Lend it a hand, keep it from dying, hopefully. Oh shit, there we go. I think one of them just exploded. Do I have any? No, I don't. I have nothing left.
Yeah, you can kind of kite him around and make him uh, fire rockets into the other in, into the other demons. It's always real satisfying when that happens, especially when they blow up like a whole squad of dudes. Oh, thank God, blue armor. All right, we'll finish placing these later because we got some bullshit to deal with. Did this turret just get wrecked already? That's disappointing on so many levels. Uh, I keep forgetting what these things are called. The weird, the weird ass brown things that have kind of flamethrowers, but kind of not. That hurt like an absolute motherfucker. Reload, come on. Yeah, you'll notice there's red and green blood coming out of the Hell Knights. The green blood is default blood. Uh, the red is Bolognese blood. I haven't been, I haven't been able to make the, uh... The Noble and Kako Blood mods work for Bolognese, so... Yeah, there's a... Oh, Catharsi, that's it. That's what they're called. And we'll save these five. Reload. Just pump away these things until they die. This one's getting a little too close for comfort. Okay, Spectre down. Okay, I dodged right into that one. Okay, one more, one more, and then three more waves after that. God help me. Okay, there we go. Let's drop some of these mines here. Let's put one here and one here. Rocket launcher, awesome. Thank you, sir. I won't quite pull it out yet. Because I don't want to I don't want to use it on uh, pinkies unless I have to. Man, just look at them fly. But by that I mean all by that I mean all their limbs and shit. Okay, that's one flight clear. Chewing through the bear here. Uh oh, reload. There he goes. Uh oh. Do I have any other? No, I don't. Great. Okay, uh, time for health. This is cutting it. Okay, mine's got him. Oh, cells. Do I get a plasma gun? That's a soul sphere. Fuck yeah. I should have really gotten the med kits before I got that. That's my fault. Because I'm a dumbass. Clear the, clear the left, then the right, and then the center. One by one, let's go to work. Oh god, 38 of them. How are we doing everywhere else? Okay, okay, time to switch. No, I came too far to fail. 
said literally every person who's ever lost anything in history, to be fair. God, that is a lot of shit. Fireballs, and whatever those orange things are. Any more ammo to be had? Yes, plenty of it. Thank God. Just start chewing through more of them. Eat a dick, Catharsi. Oh yeah, and they, they, uh, they, when those Catharsi die, they drop, like, uh, essentially it's like the martyrdom perk from COD. They could, instead of dropping a grenade, they drop one of these orbs, and it spawns that! You can use it to your advantage to hurt demons, but mostly I just end up getting screwed by it. Oh, plasma rifle. And that's a mega sphere, which I will absolutely take. All right, come here. Oh, it's so nice to have some energy firepower. Oh, look at him detonate. Absolutely chunked. What? Nope. I don't fucking think so. I'm about to run out of plasma, but I've got plenty of other ammo left. You big cybernetic bitch. Okay, that was closer than I'd like. I think it's just Baron's left now. Come here, boy. <sighs> Oh my god. Brilliant job, thank you. Oh, that... Oh, if you want to get your heart rate up, play this. Holy crap. Oh, look at all the money I'm rolling in. Jesus. Alright. Well, I think that's going to do it for me for this episode here. I'm going to record at least one more tonight. Um... Just, uh, there we go. Um, I'm gonna record at least one more tonight because this mod is so much fun. It's like cocaine. I love it. I don't love coke though. <laughs> anyway, I'll just, I'll, <laughs> I'll, I'll leave you guys with that. Have a good one, and I will see you in the next episode.